Hey guys, so this is going to be a follow on from my blinking tutorial that I did um, the other day and this is just going to be because a few people asked about almost blink blinking automatically so I'm going to incorporate this with my previous one of my previous tutorials which is about a timer so I'm going to combine the blinking with the timer to create something that um, where you blink just automatically say every you know a couple of seconds you can change it depending on what you know you feel that's best but I'll do this now and what we do is I've deleted um, the left click option from the update function so we can pretty much start again so we've still got the stuff the two variables and the stuff in the start what we need to do we need to make a variable called timer set that to type flow and set it equal to 2.0 you know whatever you want your timer to be equal to really then we're going to make a private variable and call that blink set that as type boolean set equal to false and then within the update function we want to say that timer minus equals time dot delta time so that means it'll just count down every you know second or so with depending what timer is equal to then we need to say if timer is less than or equal to zero then add two curly brackets underneath and we'll say that timer is equal to two so we're resetting the timer when it gets to zero and then blink is equal to true and then underneath here we'll say that if blink is equal to true then add two curly brackets and in there and what we'll do under here like we did in the other script we're just going to pay, well, we're just going to put, you know, top lid dot animation dot play and the animation that we had, and bottom lid dot animation dot play with the, um, the bottom, um, animation that we have, and then we're going to say blink is equal to false. So we'll save that, out. and what this does is the timer will count down. When two seconds gets to zero, then the timer will be reset to two. Blink will equal true, and if it is equal true, it'll play the animation. After the animations have played, it will be set back to false, so we can't do it until the timer goes down at each point. So make sure that's attached to your main camera or wherever you've got um, you want your script to go, and you walk around, you know, and then you'll see automatically that the blink will actually happen. And you can see down at the bottom, you'll see that two seconds counts down. You know, you can make this as much as you want, but um, you see, no matter what I do, the animation still plays all of the time till you tell it to stop or till you do a counter to stop it after a certain amount of times. Well, that was pretty much it. Pretty brief, but it was pretty simple. Thanks very much for watching, and as ever, if you like the tutorial, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Cheers.